What's going on guys, John with the Pro Cut, and today we're out here and we're gonna assemble our Yukon five tier storage rack that we got from Harbor Freight uh, out here in the greenhouse so I can get more plants in here. So let's get to it. So as you can see, you've got posts that go between the shelves. You got end plugs and a couple of hooks to hook to a wall if you're putting it in a garage. And then you've got five shelves and so let's start assembly you just put the posts in here and then you put the end plugs on the bottom of the bottom one and the top of the top one and that's all there is to it. so there are differences between the top and bottom caps that being your bottom caps are hollow and your top caps actually have a cap so your bottom caps are simply going to slide into the bottom holes on one of your shelving units and then you're going to put four posts in and then your next shelf is ready to go on and then the next shelf and the next set of posts and so on and so on so in my greenhouse i can only accommodate four shelves high so the fifth shelf i'll put the legs on it and i'll set it on top of my table over here now you can see I've got the fifth shelf. I put the legs on it and it's just sitting on top of this table. So I was able to clear this stuff off of here. I've got these trays here that I accidentally killed the seedlings that were in there with my grow lights. I left them on for too long and I closed the vents and cooked them. So then on these shelves over here, I've got two flats of dragon fruit cactus and I've got some Roma tomatoes over here. I've got a little juniper, some more dragon fruit cactus. I've got a pawpaw seed back here that's not germinated yet. I've got some peas that have germinated. Uh, these caps, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them as of right now. I don't really see a reason to use them. And then up here, I've got another flat of dragon fruit cactus and I've got some sunflowers and some spinach that I'm trying to germinate. And then in here, I'm still trying to germinate some lettuce. And these are the cactus that I burned with the lights, but I'm seeing if they come back, we'll see. And then there's some herbs that I'm trying to germinate here. And it looks like there's one little chive popping up in this corner. So we'll continue to see what happens with them. Everything I'm doing out here is just, you know, experimenting and trying to learn new things. And in my self wicking container, the baby spinach is starting to look pretty good. Three varieties of radish are doing well. I've got four little beets coming up and still not seeing any carrots germinated just yet. So we'll continue to watch them and see what happens and like, comment and subscribe. And thanks for watching my video. I appreciate you guys.